Hello from the little isle of Ischia. Hello from Ischia. <laughs> we are here slowly moving towards the beach. And uh, what to say? Yeah. I'm absolutely sure we will come again. It is perfect place for vacation in summer. Yeah. We arrived here on uh, 11 of July 2024. And uh, the first thing we did, uh, we... Uh, got somebody. In the <laughs> Hello, Hello, how are morning. you? How are you? <laughs> this is our great guy. Hi. <laughs> <laughs> Okay. This Ciao. is the guy who gave us food yesterday in the restaurant. Oh, no, it's fantastico. Fantastico no. food. So, so, uh, so we came to Ischia by boat. The yeah. views were amazing, but we were sitting inside the boat because somehow there is no much um, space uh, outside. But it was beautiful because we stopped in island uh, Placida, yeah, Placida yes, island, yeah. and then we came to Ischia. So then we did one more smart thing. We bought uh, <laughs> one week tickets, which we are now desperate to utilize. Yeah. around the island because it's only two buses yeah. roaming around the island <coughs> it takes like a, an hour to go the full way around the island the full island is that's here. right and we got these tickets and the next and the, day and the buses are something really special you should see them when they go <laughs> like five centimeters from <laughs> the wall Italians fighting in the exactly buses. Obviously yeah their specialty they go inside the bus and they start fighting we well, like Joby squeeze in like amazed. sardines <laughs> as well so that's really cool and uh yes yeah, so, so the, the, yeah. then uh, we went to san montana beach yeah, and which is like the, it's a 800 meter walk from here oh but yeah, it's, it's, it's like a heaven beautiful. but the, the mistake we did uh, we burn ourselves very badly because we didn't expect yeah. the strength of the sun is so high no. and we didn't uh, sit there more than two hours probably but toby is now obliged to wear t-shirts till yeah. the last day is full of blisters mate because full of blisters, blisters. Yeah. but uh we're still happy and uh, for me personally, I've never been in a better place for summer vacation. I've never been in a better place than this, really. It's uh, like a road to heaven. Oh, that's good. Uh, like vanilla. Now we're going to see the best beach in, in Ischia. Some little vendors down by the sea. And hello to the Mediterranean. It's been a long time since I've seen your face. Ingresso, free beach. That's what we want. I think we're going to feel some fire today. Sorry? This is the best ever beach. <laughs> we arrived, San Montana. It's really beautiful. Have a look at it. This is, this is the free side of the beach. You can rent these uh, seats and parasols for. One chair or in the corner, Yeah, we'll go wherever it doesn't matter. But it's like 25 euros for two for the day. So if we're here for two weeks. That'll be rather a lot. Staking our claim now. Let's have a look down the beach. Ah. I wait to try the water, it's probably a bit chilly. No, it's nice. Ready? Okay. I'll put my feet in, then we'll go out a bit. So day two, yeah. after being so burnt on day one. Day one we day went two. to uh, Nitrodi. It is uh, ancient uh, water in the mountains. And I really like it, Toby not. He said it's just a shower. <laughs> but we spent a few hours with a guide who was guide uh, named Anna. And when I asked her how long she is living there, she said 8,000 years. 8,000 years. Give us some clarity on, uh, <laughs> on, who we on where we with. are. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So she's uh, 8,000 8, years. years. But water was good. We, we healed. But it goes uh, back to like 800 BC. That, that the Greeks found it originally, it makes it unusual. And the Romans. And there are a lot of artifacts in the place that they were yeah. using the water and source of water in the wall, their mother right. Nitrodi. So and we were here drinking on the water the island, and we managed not to get the poops. Yeah, that was nice. <laughs> and the, the, the every shop in uh, Ischia sells Nitrodi cosmetics, various creams yeah. and everything. So the one price I saw, it's like 30 pounds per tube so, of cream. So that's what it's famous for, yeah, yeah. Uh, this Ischia, because it has yeah. uh, 300 Various, hot, springs. Uh, hot springs. We have even in our hotel. We've got a hot spring. I, I feel absolutely rejuvenated. My <laughs> old skin. I feel like I'm uh, like uh, 20 years old. Top is just bread, but all is so tasty. I can't tell you. Mm. I've got a little bruschetta thing going on with cockles, coppolina. This is what's this? Gnocchi. 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 The nice gnocchi. I'll try now with cheese. And I just had this is uh, penne with uh, tomato. Mm. Mine is very tasty. Yeah. 
Sorry? By mistake. Yeah, and I've got lemon and uh, what did they say? I can't remember what it was now. It's vanilla and it's nuts. Of course, the obligatory espresso because we're thirsty, it's really hot. It's really hot. I really want to come here to be very nice to sit here. And the water, I'm sure, very nice. So, this is Vlada walking along. This is her breakfast attire in the hotel. She bought it specifically to go to the breakfast, all right? But what we also realized was there's a really nice supermarket here. It sells lots of great cheese, fruits and vegetables, and salami. So we're going there now to stock up because we have a little fridge in our room, which is really cool. Jesus, and all the hands standing up. Vlad hanging with the locals. <laughs> and a bite some cheese. I hear number nine. Here's all the mozzarella. It's pretty cheap actually. Three euros, two. This is the best one I think. This one is called mozzarella buffalo, 250 yen. Ten So we have a whole strip of mozzarella and then around here. So different mozzarella. This one I really liked had skin on. So we're gonna be things. Which one do you think? I do. I'm in heaven, <laughs> I, I'm in love with this kid. Whoa. I'm in love with this kid. This is the only place I want to come from. My <sighs> and I'm having to wear a t shirt because I'm all full of blisters from <laughs> too much sun on, on day one. <laughs> Can you believe it? Oh. Oh. Hello, my love. I'm in love with this care because uh, it's like everything actually you want you find here for the summer vacation everything you need yes. you need thermal water thermal water you need massage <laughs> by the way we have to book a massage that's right you want to see 8,000 year old women there's one you in can. the firm you can go you want to go to crater to mountain Epomea you can there is castle the food you want expensive food go to the Cornish want for cheaper food go three streets away there are Italian couple yeah. doing chicken and and it was remarkable it was. 30 pounds for dinner for three with chicken meat sausages and bottle of wine 30 That's pounds right. a bottle of wine that was and cool it was two pounds 50 or something <laughs> three pounds <laughs> bottle of wine was pounds, yeah. actually good wine really i good like wine, it yeah. i didn't I have any too. problem the chicken and potatoes we got this is the rice balls and these two are potato croquettes i've been trying this italian sausage chips Dan's having half a chicken rice balls and potato and a bottle of wine and all for 30 30 euros, euros. and uh, but you go to the Cornish you walk on the promenade you will have a dinner like for 80 90 100 whatever you wish and yeah. it's absolutely on but we haven't spent more than 100 pounds on, on food yeah we, we haven't didn't, no. <laughs> and uh, and and uh, like what else do you wish to for summer vacation? Yeah. You want to go on the boat trip? You can go on the boat trip. And the supermarket's near us as well. That's supermarket pretty cool. Supermarket on the so. corner. And they are very, very good one. I bought a lot of smoked meats today. You did. Probably put big, like these huge ones. <laughs> I, I don't know. two salamis. Will you consume them? I will. And there are tomatoes, my God. Yeah, Olive oil. Ah, the food is so tasty. And they're also no foreigners except us. Yeah, we see. Seen... Full yeah, beach of full beach of, of Italians. Let's just pan around and have a look at the full beach yeah. of Italians. These and the mushroom, the, the favorite bit is the mushroom. Yeah, this is the beach from here. So here we are, Sombrero Beach. Free beach for all free people. It's a free world, a free beach. It's very difficult to see over there, but there's a little island here, right, which is, I can't what it's called, begins with a P. And over there, right in the distance, which is probably out of shot, so slightly, that's Vesuvius. And over that side there, this Naples. Our second day in the Tamar Beach. So, this is where I got burnt on the first day very badly. 
hence why I'm wearing my t-shirt now and I've got my hat on the beach but you can see I've got sports in my my sports in my what summer cut <laughs> so no hair care products required here we have the beef how's it going love? Very well, I'm so happy here. Yeah, I'm allergic planning on the uh, little moments in the water. <laughs> so beautiful. Yeah. So actually, we're swimming along. Actually, we're finding a little location right now because every now and again the hot springs pop up from so under the sea. So we are sitting now on the hot springs, and uh, it's yeah. so nice. A little bit one meter aside and it's already uh, colder, but here it's warm. And people finding them and concentrating around. We came for Leko Ameno to Mickey, Porto in Ischia the in a sardine bus. It was absolutely mad. <laughs> and then we didn't actually know that we actually arrived at the port until somebody kicked us out from the castle. And With uh, 100 it. Italians and 300 <laughs> uh, suitcases. All, and all shouting at each other. And we are all dressed and evening dresses yeah. and everything. So but the castle's behind us here and actually when I turn the camera around you will see it's like a little Venice actually. Cause something. No, and town around the castle, yeah, absolutely really mesmerizing. It says something. I it never is. saw anything similar to this. No. It's just, it's not even Venice, it's very different. It's like uh, medieval, yeah. but at the same time, it's uh, we know it's island and yeah. it's like, and yesterday I was researching about Ischia, how many, battles were around Ischia, how many different armies came here, how many people changed, the rulers changed, this castle was given from one hand to another. It's obviously such a mix of various cultures and you can see it in the, these little buildings and all. it's uh, something Yeah, it's really nice, but the main thing is I think it's very, very clean, people are very friendly, it's very polite, uh, the beaches are fantastic, really immaculate, uh, no rubbish, no anything at all on there, so it's, it's really, really good. Central Design Mazala. I'm waiting to be come to the point where we see the castle. This is a big trend too, wearing cowboy boots, we lots of women doing this. Cowboy boots on a hot day. We're we'll stopped for a photo opportunity. And we can see the castle up there. This Castello Aragonese and it's a uh, Aragonese, yes. <laughs> it's absolutely beautiful castle. I don't know if we are going inside or not. We will uh, approach the castle and we will see now. But yeah. the weather, the breeze, the views, the uh, I just wanted this moment to last forever, really. It's one of the best days of my life. Really? Oh, my I'll keep these memories because uh, maybe you think that uh, I don't know what I think, but I think about the moment. It's it's uh, one of the most beautiful in my life. Really, oh. I never been in places like that. No. Never. And it's all with you. Yeah. A little restaurant on the beach. Yeah. So the That's restaurant the next to the castle, actually. Yeah. yeah. The restaurant's called Coco, and it's a fish restaurant. Fully booked, but I found it some. Uh, I'll show you the table, some long table which we're at the end of it. But actually, it's nice breeze here. But it's a nice breeze here. We we now ordered um, all our favorite food. I ordered fish, 
done all the spaghetti with clams and uh, calamari. Oh, the beef. Yeah. And, and we got uh, another beer. So hot, man. It's cooking, cooking, mate. And you got an apparel to keep you happy. And the restaurant is getting more and more busy, but on, on our huge table, nobody is <laughs> yeah. here. I'm in, the, in my oven with this fried fish. It's so good here. So how was that, love? The fish was so good. I cannot tell you. If it if can come again, uh, I would be very happy to support this idea. <laughs> really? And especially what I like, little portion of limoncello at the end. Oh, so you feel like uh, your digestion is working properly and you can kind of... Uh, This is the sea where we were yesterday down here. So this one starts at 18 degrees and then it comes all the way around here. It finishes up at 38 degrees. It's 38 degrees. Pull in again. So here we got two pools. One is 18 degrees and the other one is 40. And it's uh, a real shock when you jump in. So voluntary for us today we have Vlada. Vlada, the exceptional sports person of the century. Anything to say? Hello? Anything to say before you jump in? Okay. Alright, good luck. <laughs> Okay. Feels really, really cold. Hold it. Hold it. <laughs> and jump to the warm. Opa! This is the Wim Hof eat your heart out moment. So each waterfall here has a different pressure. And uh, I think some of them are different temperatures as well. So you basically go through some of the upper body and some of the lower body. Leave me behind the bush.
Yeah, via Furio. Via Furio? No. Yeah. Eh, I was talking with Molly, I don't know what to say. I don't know what to say. Cheers. So we got lemon. No soda this time. So it's lemon. I think it's a bit sweet with the. With the sorry. Okay. A bit of sugar in it. I think it's a bit sweet. Pathway down to Sant'Angelo. So, welcome to Sant Angela. It's uh, our last few days in Ischia, so we decided to visit the place, despite uh, Toby didn't want to go much because of the bus uh, journey. And uh, people in the bus, like, uh, well, I call it herrings. But still, we decided to go. We took the bus, the journey was like 15 minutes, and we are here in uh, Sant Angela, and we will explore the place. They said it's one of the most beautiful towns of Ischia, actually. They said the cutest one is uh, La Coamena, where we say, because it's smallest. And the most beautiful is uh, Sant Angela. The restaurant. We nearly stayed in this pink hotel at one point. I think it was just open. So right now, Vlad is deciding whether to get a coral rose ring or not. This is can you see? This is this is a ring, but I'm thinking it's wood, and in the center it is a rose made of coral, and it's really beautiful, actually. Authentic place, yeah. So yeah. should be good. Calzone. Yours is what's made of? It's speciality of Ischia. It's a uh, aubergine with mozzarella. It's speciality of this place. Also. And you got some uh, peppers. peppers. I'm about to start eating, but it's actually hard. It's called the macatalano. You see? And this is tiramisu. Very good, crack it. Hey, it like, that. like this? Ah, uh, uh, let's try to. Ah, uh, very hot. No. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. That's Rob Wood, our cat and ran. Boiling hot. Time to be going. Dispatch. Waiting to dispatch. Yeah, we made it. We made it. That walk, which I, I wanted to do that walk so much yesterday, we couldn't do. Yeah. Yeah, that's it. Bye, Iskia. Bye. Oh, let's see you. you.
current nipples. Next to the castle. <laughs> 